Today we'll talk on how to fix a strange character that appear in, uh, after WordPress uh, migrating or a new installation or upgrading, etc. or moving to a new server. As you see, we have lots of strange characters here. You see here, and here, and also here. So, for example, this character is supposed to be an apostrophe. Okay? So, what we're gonna do is just to copy that and go to our PHP my admin and perform a search. And what we want to do is just to search for this strange character that should be replaced with an apostrophe. Okay, let's select all and we go. Now we'll find where we meet it. Okay, for example, we meet it a lot in post, in post meta and user meta and comments okay so let's browse the comments so we open that and we see that in this table in comments and under comment author we have lots of those things Okay, lots of strange characters. Also, we have it under comments content. So, what we want to do, we want to run an SQL query. And this SQL query would be specific and individual for each case, for each table. There are lots of plugins, but uh, they either outdated, not updated for more two years, or they, uh, accordingly to the feedback, they do not work well. So what we want to do is to copy this exact, if you have prefix WP or other prefix, so use that. We have our own prefix here, so we want to copy it here. And here is the query. So first of all, we replace this. Then we go and, for example, we want to modify this column. So we want to copy over so this text. So we replace it here and we replace it the same here. So which of the strange characters here, yeah, this one. So we want to copy forward to first position here. And then we want to replace it with apostrophe. Apostrophe is a tricky. So what we want to do is to provide some column, then apostrophe again some column. Okay. And then we want to run this SQL query here. So we want to go to our database to query, oh, pardon, to SQL, just copy it over and go. So we'll just pack it to rows and uh, what we want to do next is go to and copy over this next column where we met this uh, strange character and it will be comment content. Place it once again here and once again here. Uh, all the same will be for posts here, and under post, we need to choose relevant counts as well. Okay, so actually, this is how it works. So let's go back and let's return back to our database to SQL. Over and let's click on here. 46 rows affected. So that's how it works.